save them. But we begin with 13 freeway shootings under investigation throughout Metro Detroit in just the past few weeks. It's not the work of a single person and there is no sniper, but violence on our roads is on the rise. Our Mara McDonald is live downtown in Mara with a few exceptions. Most of these shootings are directly attributed to road rage. Kimberly, that's right, and here's the thing. Road rage around here certainly is not new, but what's different this time is the volume of how many of we, we have had of these in the last few weeks, and all of them involve firearms. The majority of these freeway shootings have been because of everyday agitations. A simple lane violation, uh, disrespecting somebody by the way you know they looked at them, uh, maybe cut them off, maybe going too fast, maybe going too slow, maybe doing one of those things that made them decide that they needed to pull out a handgun and fire around at somebody. Only two of the 13 shootings have been domestic. Most of these are strangers who think pulling out a gun to show your displeasure at someone's driving is somehow normal. Just this evening, Detroit police were out on the Davison near 75 for the 13th shooting. The driver who was shot at didn't want his face shown, but gives you an idea how it all started. I was on 75 between seven mile and eight mile and a guy was behind me and he, you know, he was at a high rate of speed and he got up on me. He couldn't get by because, you know, it's construction. This man says the other driver tried to squeeze through and sideswiped his car, but then pulled over and told him to follow him. That's when he says it came to shots and virtually all of the accused shooters had illegal firearms. We haven't had this many road rage incidents without firearms, let alone with firearms. Um, we haven't seen things like this where people are just mad about something. Back here live, the word from MSP tonight is just let it go. It's not worth trying to shoot somebody or potentially killing somebody because they cut you off in traffic. So far, the numbers look like this. 12 of these incidents have been in Wayne County. One in Oakland. We're live downtown tonight. I'm Mara McDonald. Back to you.